I was approached by Max and Co very organically through Giorgio Guidotti and and it was a very nice sort of way of getting to know each other because I have a lot of respect for the Max Mara group and all the quality and the years of making beautiful clothes and they asked you know if I would do this collaboration and I was thrilled. For this collection in particular, I wanted to have something Italian mixed with the rest of the world. So it's, it's inspired by Luigi Ghiri, who was a great Italian artist, photographer, and the way he shot parts of Italy, very simple things. I imagined him going to another part of the world, like Bamako in Mali or Dakar in Senegal. And I just decided to mix those two ideas to give the whole thing harmony because I feel that that's what life is about, a really good mix. And I was also watching, I love Antonioni and the films of, with Monica Vitti. So some of that came in, but really Giri was the main inspiration. So the accessories, uh, at first, they, it wasn't supposed to have any accessories, but you know, I'm old school and my mother was Jamaican, so the shoes and the bags are very important. And I decided to do two types of accessory, one a flat with this um, technique in the basket weave, which also appears as a fabric, again to mix, because I like the fact that on the foot, you have attention to detail. But I like a flat, I always think a flat shoe is good, but in this case, we have the tie and we have another shoe which is a white loafer and I love a white shoe I think it's very chic very both um, a bit vintage but also a bit modern and it makes it gives the clothes a bit more of a hard edge and I think the, the young woman that wears Max and Co wants beautifully made almost classically cut things but things that are interesting and she wants to wear it her own way so we have this white patent loafer with the printed interior which i think is also a great sort of feeling for the summer white accessories or anything with white are always great